We want to welcome all of His Glory Ministry from east to west to north to south. We want to give a special thank you, a very heart, uh, a heart thank you to each and every one of you as we have gone over 1.4 million followers all over the world on all of our platforms, including HisGlory.me, HisGlory.tv, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and more. We just went over 800,000 thousand followers on Facebook alone. We are literally in every single country of the world today and the ministry is growing in the name of the Most High God through His glory. And it's all we do is to glorify His name. And one of the most wonderful things is we're, he, we're hitting over 1.4 million people and I would say 1.3 million and change don't even know who I am because all glory goes to the Most High God. It's all about Him and it's about His glory. We're seeing the supernatural in every area of the world. And um, what we're seeing is that we're reaching over 1.5 million people each week. So that 1.5 million are just physical touches that we can tell through technology. We don't know how many more are above that. We know they're much, much more than 1.5 million. For example, we're hitting churches in Pakistan, Kenya, India, all over the world that one may bring in their cell phone, but three or 400 in the church are watching us live each and every day. So we're hitting probably 10 times more than the 1.4 million and the 1.5 million that we're touching each week. Our Bible studies are hitting record numbers. It is just absolutely skyrocketing. We have uh, between 65 and 80,000 people are watching our Bible studies each and every week. Those, again, are one touches. That means one person on one phone is doing that. But we know in areas of India, Pakistan, Kenya, Liberia, for example, that that one person represents three to 400 people within that church because they're using those teachings for their church. We have His Glory Liberia, His Glory Kenya, soon to have His Glory Pakistan, His Glory India, his glory Jerusalem, and there will be a His glory in every single nation under the sun, all for the glory of the Most High God. Praise His name. Again, 80,000 people a day, a day that we're reaching in Bible studies, if not more. We are doing, um, uh, we're doing live Facebook Live, and we're using Skype, and we're using technology to go in to do live revivals in places like Pakistan. We did three in Pakistan in the last month that are just touching thousands and thousands of people that could not see the gospel. We're literally fulfilling Matthew 24, as the scripture says, that the, the gospel shall be preached in every nation under the sun. And to, he, to touch each creation and with modern technology, we're able to do Skype and li a Facebook Live and other forms of live um, uh, uh, directly through different platforms to touch the masses of people where you couldn't get in there in times past. So thousands and thousands are literally coming to Christ from His glory ministry, and all glory goes to God. Now we're going to get into the stats. People want to hear what, what countries we're in, the top 10 countries that, he, that His glory is in today. The unique thing is eight out of the top 10 are Muslim countries. We're going right into the area where they're wanting the to know who Jesus Christ is. And again, thousands and thousands who were raised in the Muslim tradition, Muslim religion, are coming to know the Most High God through his relationship with Jesus Christ. Number one is the number one Muslim country in the world in population is Indonesia. Number two is Pakistan. Number three is Algeria. Number four is India. Number five is Iraq. Number six is Libya, of all places. Number seven in staying is the United States of America. We are growing in every single country leaps and bounds. The only country we are not growing in and we're staying stagnant is the United States of America. And that's ironic. But the Lord is going to have a great revival come to America. America is going to wake up and get rid of their old ways, their old traditions, their old denomination, and get their heart back to the Lord in a great end time revival, because that will happen. The Lord is going to touch the heart of the United States, so we look forward to the United States with His glory to explode and grow like the rest of the country and the rest of the countries are. Egypt is number eight. Number nine is Saudi Arabia. Believe it or not, Saudi Arabia 
where you where they monitor the internet. His glory has snuck in and is the ninth of our, our top countries. And the United Arab em Emirates is number 10. So out of 10, the, our top 10, eight of them are Muslim countries. One is a large Hindu country. So we're going into areas that have never heard the gospel. Praise his name. And the rest of the, the top uh, are Brazil, Malaysia, Chad, Central African Republic, Vietnam, Mexico, Turkey, Germany, the Philippines, Tamar Lesti, Afghanistan, Bangladesh, Oman, France, China, Italy, the United Kingdom, Cameroon, Jordan, Thailand, Kuwait, Tunisia, South Africa, Morocco, Bahrain, Canada, Nepal, Nigeria, Qatar, Greece, Australia, Le Lebanon, Taiwan, Cambodia, and Russia, even into communist Russia. The, the top five countries, in the, or the top five cities in the world that we're in. Lahore, Pakistan is number one. Number two is uh, North Sumatra, uh, East Java in Indonesia. Algiers is number three. Karachi in Pakistan is number four. West Java in Indonesia. And we see Baghdad and Tripoli being in the top 10, going into areas where they're not seeing the gospel before because of technology, because of the internet, praise the Most High. The top 10 languages that we're reaching people all over the world, again, Facebook and YouTube and some of these uh, places that we use, we have interpreters and they also translate in certain things. Indonesian language is number one, English is number two, Arabic is number three, uh, French, number four, Urdu, which is the, the, the native long, uh, tongue of Pakistan is number five, Portuguese, because Brazil is growing strong, Spanish, Hindu, and that's the top list. Out of all of our countries, 85% of them are from Muslim countries. We're, God is taking his glory into Muslim countries all over the world, and thousands are coming to know the living Christ through his glory ministry. Glory to him in the highest. And out of that 85%, 90% of the followers of his glory are millennials. They're the youth. Exactly what it said in the book of Joel, the end times, that the sons and daughters will prophesy. And he's reaching the youth. They're not caught up in the traditions of their parents and their grandparents. They're looking to know who the risen Christ is, and they're reaching his glory in record numbers. Again, thousands are coming into his glory as Jesus Christ is their Savior. Each and every week, we're seeing many, many wonderful testimonies of people accepting Christ every single day. We did a prayer revival last week, the first time that we did that, and we went live all over the world and uh, offering prayer requests uh, live. And we had five or six, uh, actually six miracles that were reported back to us with supernatural healing. Two of them actually went back to their doctor and their doctor said, this was an absolute miracle. This should never have happened. And that came, they give glory to God and to his glory because we prayed over them and God touched them supernaturally. So the Lord is doing mighty things in the name of his glory. His glory has just started with over 1.4 million, probably well over 200 million when you count the churches, and it's growing and growing and growing. The gospel is spreading more, like more, no other time in the history. And his glory has not even scratched the surface. We're just at the tip of the iceberg of what the Lord has for this ministry. We plan on having a his glory church in every single country of the world as we're in every country of the world. We can continue to do more Facebook Lives and Skypes throughout the country and traveling to these countries and doing live revivals and bringing people in to Christ, bringing in the harvest. Many, many want to know who the living Christ is and his glory is bringing them in and the supernatural is happening all over his glory nation. So it's spreading all over. People ask, what can you do for his glory? The thing that we ask for you from you the most is pray for wisdom. Pray for the ministry of his glory to give us guidance from the most high God, to bring in the harvest, to bring in the loss, to have the spiritual wisdom that can only come from God the Father, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit to be able to do the right things for his purpose and for his glory to share the gospel from east to west to north to south so people will have a love relationship between their heart 
and the heart of the Most High God through His beloved Son, Jesus Christ. Again, thank you to everyone across His glory nation, literally in every country of the world, 1.4 million and much, much more that we can't track that are following us each and every day, touching 1.5 million people a week, up to upwards of 80,000 people a day are watching our Bible study and more because of the churches. And we've just reached today over 800,000 followers on Facebook alone. And all glory goes to God. And we thank each and every one of you. We want your prayer request. We want you to pray for the ministry of his glory and bring us your prayer request to Facebook, to all our platforms, to www.hisglory.me through our forums. And our prayer warriors are going to go and put their knees on the ground and search the Most High God and pray for each and every one of you. May the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob bless each and every one of you. And shalom. God bless you.